Welcome back. Nathan's gonna try to pull a victory out of his ass. <laughs> like I do. I'm pretty good at this. Yeah. I've played Yu-Gi-Oh! before. Your ass is known to grant treasures. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Jeez, your cat just freaked out. Yeah, she'll do that. She's broken. You cats are all broken, man. In some special new Ah, way. fuck oh, my life. Jesus. He so, is. Sarah. What? Is that is that undressed now? Or he, is that showing, him still? Uh, I think he's showing his uh, insides to you. Well, I don't understand what that is. All the machinery and whatnot on the inside of the suit. Yeah, but is that still him there? Yeah. That's him leaving. Oh, okay. He's just like, my ass. In a very doofy fashion. That's not a pleasant sight, though. No. Uh, if you don't look at the cameras too often while he's out like that, then he will run. And sometimes when we close your door, you can see him hit it. Like, no, run straight cool. into it. You're 50%. You got four hours left, buddy. I got this. You might die. Nah, you'll be fine. No, I'll totally lose this, but... No, nah, you're good. Don't worry about it. I got this. Don't worry about it. He needs to move. No, you're good. Just, I think you can actually wait a little longer between lights. Conserve power. Take a camera, though. Yeah, okay. You're good. Oh, God. This game is draining. <laughs> yeah, double entendre. Ha-ha. <laughs> um, let's talk about Adam Sandler, though. All right. What about him? I don't know, I figured he would have something to say. <laughs> um, I've completely given up on him. I still like him. I like his old stuff. I appreciate some of the newer stuff he's doing. Such as? Um, Grown Ups 2. Grown Ups? Nah. I, I like Grown Ups. Hot Tub Time Machine? Jesus. Jesus. He was in Hot Tub Time Machine? No, I was wrong. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Um... Like, all of his stuff is good in a way when you want to enjoy yourself without using your brain. Like, you ever seen Here's My Boy? Yeah. It was, f it was Go okay. away, man. What'd you think of it? Here's My Boy? Yeah. Or That's My Boy? That's My Boy. Uh, I liked it. It was okay. Like, I think it was mostly for the actor that was in it. Adam Sandler? No. What's his name? What is his name? Ah, oh, God. The guy from Lonely Island. Uh, God. Um, because that was totally him in it, right? I don't know. I'm pretty sure that was him. Seth Rogen. That what? Shut up. Jesus fucking Christ. I don't know. You want me to look hey. it up real quick? I'll look it up real quick. Go for it. Thank you. <laughs> Can I have cases? Thank you. Stop being gay on the camera. You give people the diabetes. Ah, shit! What'd you do? Ah! <laughs> did you really get scared? I did. Was that Foxy? That was. That, that was a stupid-looking fox. Like, as soon as I turned on the light, it just jumped in. I was not expecting that. I told you to do that. Alright, alright. It wasn't even a run-in. That was like a strolling, like a, Hey, guy, how's it going? Oh, oh, hi, it's my Foxy! Here's another issue. Why don't they just give people suits? Oh, yeah, yeah. You, you, Just you brought fucking that up. give me a suit. That is true. Like, bro. That's my boy. Not it's a boy. 2012. God, it was two hours long. It got a 20% on Rotten Tomatoes. Out of? Presumably 100%. Rotten Tomatoes, like, hates every movie, though. God, I thought it said, while still a teen himself. It, it says, while still a teen himself. I thought it said, when a teen kills himself. <laughs> I was like, whoa, shit. Whoa. Whoa. I couldn't remember the name of the movie. That's my boy? No. Uh, reference to a teen off. killing oh. himself. Oh, uh, World's uh, Greatest Dad. World's Greatest Dad. Great didn't technically, movie. Didn't technically try it. to kill himself. Andy Samberg. Wanna... Andy Samberg. That's his fucking name. Sorry, what were you saying? Uh, I was just... Didn't really want to see Robin Williams' dick, and always remember... You know you wanted to see Robin Williams' dick. God bless him and rest in peace. 
always remember the Michael Sarah trio. Uh, Michael Sarah, Jesse Eisenberg, Andy Samberg. Yeah, yeah. Do you ever see the uh, the Pokemon evolutions of them and all that? Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't Michael Sarah like the first evolution? Yeah, yeah. And then it was Jesse Eisenberg, and then uh, whatever, yeah. whatever the guy's name is. Oh. Uh, Lonely, Lonely Island. Andy, Andy Samberg. Lonely Island. <laughs> Just increasingly more Jewish. <laughs> what are some other good actors? Michael Sarah. Michael, Michael. You love Michael fucking Sarah. Sarah. You stole every one of my Michael Sarah movies. Not all of them. Almost all of them. A good portion. <laughs> I mean, I've you never love Michael them. Sarah so much. Look at your girlfriend's name. <laughs> Sarah, I love you. You're I love you, Sarah. I love you. Me or uh, or both of you. <laughs> what did I even do? Just that joke made me like regret my existence. <laughs> I'm hey, sorry. No shame in being my favorite actor. So I should look at the hallway, I don't right? Look like, yeah. I don't look like hey, him. Oh. God, he just, a rain dance he just he just fucking books it. He does. Am I good over here? Uh, Let's open the door. At, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> oh god, I might have a heart attack at some point. Where does he oh, move to on. now? I don't remember. It's look not at, even that. Oh, wow, what a bitch. Go back. Turn on the light real fast. Yeah, yeah I'm good. good. I can't see the the switch because it's directly behind the microphone. But Michael. King Sarah. Michael Sarah, you know? He's I don't like, think there's a movie... There's, there's movies by him that I don't like. Such as? Um... Because I know there are that I don't like. I'm not particularly a fan of Nick and Nora. I, I didn't mind Nick and Nora. I actually like that. Yeah, you, you were telling me that. Do you uh, remember Paper Heart very well? I'm gonna go with that's a movie I don't like. It's the one where the girl supposedly like doesn't feel loved, so they're making a documentary about her. And she ends up, I think, falling in love with actual, like, Michael Sarah, Not, like, an actor. Not, like, Michael Sarah playing a character, like, actual Michael Sarah. I don't think I've ever seen that movie. I have, if you want to borrow it. I think you keep trying to let me borrow it, and I'm just like, meh. 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 I don't like movies by Michael Sarah. Only movies where Michael Sarah plays another character. I don't actually like Michael Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's an asshole. He really is. Is he? Uh, yeah, did you ever see the uh, Adult Swim interview with him? Are, are you sure it wasn't, like... I don't know if it was staged, way. but they totally made it. He, he looked like an asshole. I can't see Michael Sarah getting, like, too big for his britches. Neither could I. Um, Michael Sarah movies that I love that... Oh. <laughs> uh, Youth and Revolt. Youth and Revolt was good. That's the one you stole. I fucking love that movie. And by stole, by the way, I don't mean like he has them and won't give them back. I mean like he took them, I got them back at some point, they don't have the DVD in them anymore, and he doesn't know where they are. This is also Pretty sure he just true. absorbed them into his body. I probably did. Hey, check your hallway. I'm good. Oh, uh, like the actual hallway? Yeah, because now you need to like keep an eye on the hallway instead of everything else. Well, no, I need to keep an eye on him because he's still there. Well, yeah, but if uh, he's... Okay, if you see him not there, gotta, then you immediately close the door. This just a bit. Okay. Um. You still here, dude? What? What? What is the name of that one movie? Uh, Scott Pilgrim. Obviously, love Scott Pilgrim. Scott Pilgrim is one of those ones where like I started giving it more critique over the years, because like there are some parts in it that are just bad. No, absolutely. Like, Roxy I... Richter, uh, the actress in that is just she's not great. Roxy. Yeah. The. Uh, the the lesbian ninja I think her name was Roxy Richter oh got it uh, Ramona's ex yeah Ramona's uh, fourth evil ex-boyfriend evil ex yeah I think in the book she doesn't correct him she's like whatever he'll figure it out eventually oh really I think I don't know I know I've read she... them but it's been a long time uh the fourth one was way different. The whole lesbian thing is when they started really breaking away from the uh, traditional mold. Or mold. The uh, <clears throat> the original story, I should say. What was the movie with McLovin? Super bad? Super bad. Another good one. How old are you? 21. Old enough. Did he actually say old enough? Old enough 
to party. <laughs> I was trying to quote the movie and then still quoted it wrong. <laughs> Um, God, this is just as tedious as if I actually had a security job. I feel like it's a little bit worse. Yeah. Because now you actually have to do things, whereas if you're a security guard, you can just watch a camera. Yeah. Speaking of which, why do you have to click the thing to bring up your camera? Why can't you literally just stare at a screen and then just be like, oh, shit, here they come. Like, lean back, yeah. click the light. Yeah, or just hide under a desk, or, you know, just, like, shut a door. Oh, something's God. coming. How do you know? I heard it. Or I'm lying. Something okay. needs to happen. Nah, that's fine. I'm enjoying talking about movies. What's an actor you <coughs> really like that I can maybe get behind in conversation with? I don't know. I don't really have, like... that. That's like... I don't ever seem learned on anything because I just... like I used to read, like, a lot, and I never read more than, like, one or two books by the same author. Because, like, I never found another one that interested me. I think uh, the guy who wrote Artemis Fowl, that's like the first time I read another book by another book by the same author. Because he wrote uh, this one called The Wishlist, which was really good. It was about a, a girl who died and she was going to be sent to hell. So she like agreed to try to fulfill this old man's last requests in an attempt to like get some brownie points. And there was a scene where like the devil was playing a Game Boy in the corner, yelling "Die, alien scum!" into the like <laughs> the screen. Oh shit! Close the door. Yeah. Is he actually going to be... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> a little tardier to the party there, buddy. Harder! Harder! Why doesn't he show up in the thing? Because he runs, smacks the door, and runs back. Oh, so he's already back? No. no. Where is he? Oh, if it says sorry out of order, then he's still behind the curtain, right? No. I don't think so. Was it closed last time then? Plus there's an animatronic in the hallway. Yeah, but they chill. You might Plus you only have 4% power left, so... Okay. Yay, death. Oh, there goes the rest of your power. Nah, that's fine. So, um, I'm, I've never been big on, like, just following an actor because they're an actor. I don't know, I'll think about that. Son of a bitch. I'll probably get back to you on the next episode. We'll see what happens here. Will I die? Will I survive? Should we leave suspense? Tune in on the next episode of OSG!